everyone, Kathy from Kathy's Vegan Kitchen. It's 100 degrees in Arizona today, so we're making a salad again, but we're going to make a sandwich spread. You can also put this um, sandwich spread inside of a tomato, inside of a red pepper. You can make a lettuce wrap out of it, a lavash. I found these great everything ciabatta buns at um, Trader Joe's, and they have no oil in them, so we like those, so I'm going to use those. So this is an artichoke chickpea salad. And we're making it kind of Mediterranean style. So I have one can, which is 15 ounces of artichoke hearts, and I roughly chop them, and I'm going to put it in my large food processor. You can, if you don't have a food processor, you can chop this up with a knife. You can smash your chickpeas. I'm just going to put it all into the in, or these two ingredients into the large food processor, pulse it a couple times just to save my hands a little work. So... That's one can of chickpeas, one can of artichokes, both rinsed. And we're going to pulse it a couple times. You don't want it mushy. You just want it broken up. So three or four times. And the result is this. Okay, it's all broken up. You see that some of the chickpeas are still full. Some of them are broken up. Some of them are mushy. So it's kind of a mixed batch. And we're going to put that into a bowl. Okay. Then I have one small red onion diced. I use my veggie chopper. I'm going to put that into the bowl. I have a half a cup of grape tomatoes, and instead of chopping them, I sliced them thin like this, and I did that on purpose just to make it so they're less juicy in there because you don't want anything wet in there. I have a quarter cup of Kalamata olives that are chopped up, and I have half of an English cucumber, and I removed the seeds before I chopped it in the chopper. And then what we're going to do is I'm going to use my little food processor. I can get it open. To make a caper vegan mayo. So I have my cashew mayo. I have a half a cup that I'm going to put into the food processor. And you can also do this by hand or in a blender if you prefer. I just like my little food processor. I have two cloves of garlic. two teaspoons of capers, and I also put one teaspoon of the brine in there, two teaspoons of Dijon mustard, and the juice of one half of a lemon. Oops. Can't have that <coughs> seed in there. I scoop it out. That's why you use a juicer. And you don't do it my way. My hand first. You don't want to eat the seeds. I guess you could. They're pretty edible, but I wouldn't. Eat them. Okay. And put the top on our little food processor. Again, you can use this in a small blender if you want. Or, yeah, a small blender. You can chop up those capers. It'd be helpful if I could put the top on. And you just want it mixed together. The capers are going to get chopped up. The garlic gets chopped up. And then we are going to need a towel. Having issues today. We're going to pour it on our salad. We want to get all of it out of there actually a really really good dressing for a regular salad too if you like capers okay and then I want to get all the dressing off so we're gonna put a little bit more in there. 
Okay, then I have two tablespoons of dill and I use fresh dill. If you wanna use dried dill, that's okay too, but you wanna use half the amount and a pinch of salt and a pinch of pepper. And then we're gonna mix it all together. We're going to transfer it to a bowl so I can show you how it looks pretty in the bowl and then we're going to make sandwiches out of it. Okay, I've transferred to a nice pretty bowl and I'm going to make Paula's sandwich. I toasted up the ciabatta bun and you want to put a generous amount of the salad on the bread. Bread smells really good. Just everything rolls are just yummy. And then I like to top with microgreens because they're my favorite. You like microgreens, Paul? Mm -hmm. They're great. Huh? They're great. I know. All right, and we'll be right back for Paul to test. Ace Master Paul. Okay, what am I eating? We're eating um, artichoke chickpea salad sandwich. Ooh, it might be messy. It might be. It might be yummy. Mmm. Oh, that's a lot of flavor. <laughs> that has a lot of flavor. Good flavor? Good flavor. Still I got stuff on your face. <laughs> you get a napkin. No, you taste didn't. the um, capers in there. Okay. Oh, yeah. You like the caper mm. mayo? That's wonderful. Yeah. Microgreens. Right. Microgreens. Eat them up. Eat them up. For you. Bye. Bye. Bye.